All right, in the flood zone. I think this is, that's never been like this before, Sam. I think it's something you've done. No, it never, we never had a flood zone here. It's always like that. I don't think it was like that. Look at you guys. It's it's so scary. Holy moly. Anyway, good morning guys. Welcome to today's video. It's mild outside, so everything is melting and it's turning to like water. Like our barn is at the bottom of a hill. Who would think to do that? Put a barn at the bottom of the hill. Look, Sam, this net would have done you good the other day. Yeah, it would have went through that for sure. That little ermite or whatever it was. All right. Okay, come on, come here. No horse will go through this. Yeah, it's a flood zone. Oh, our poor, whoa. Amazing arena, but there's like a lot of area outside. Oh my gosh, my boot. My boot is actually leaking, how the heck? Anyway, there's lots of there's spots that they can get out of the water for sure. But our bridge is underwater. Even the bird up there is freaking out. Holy moly. Look at that. Wow. If it freezes, then we're in trouble. Especially because this ball will freeze to it. We did so much work. We did so much work to try and make sure like that no water came in. <laughs> but it came in! <laughs> this is annoying. This is absolutely annoying. Sylvie brought honey out today and she was like, I'm not going in that water. You've got another thing coming if you think I should. So we have a problem. She doesn't want to go in that. Come on, pony. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Come on, come on in. you I would carry you through it. Come on. I have to get hay tomorrow so. Yeah we go through a lot of hay in winter. I feel like this is the most we've ever gone through hay. I don't remember you ever getting hay like twice a week before. That's because we have Chino here. We never had Chino. We, we had never had Chino here before. That's right. We had the girls. That's wow it. one horse changes everything. Sophie was uh, calling honey and she wouldn't come in. She was like, I'm not going through the water. <laughs> oh man, life is rough. Like, it's so funny because you think it's so bad when it's so cold. And then you think it's really bad when it's like so hot and nobody can breathe. And then you think it's so bad when everything is under ice and water. Oh my gosh, this is scary. Anyways, I guess. What's really important is to always find the good parts and not think it's so bad. Did you feed the big horses? Yes. Yes. Honey was so excited to go out today and then she saw the part of the water she's like, you think I'm going through that? <laughs> yeah, she's like, no way. Okay, so Sam wants to get, after our fiasco the other night, in the middle of the night where we had this creature running through our house, Sam wants to get a kitten. <clears throat> Yeah, kitten for the house. A kitten for the house. But do you know why I don't think it will work out? She'll grow up with Ruby and Ruby will be fine with it. Ruby is a cat chaser, like on a huge level. And I don't think she would ever hurt our cat, but she chases cats, like literally chases them. And when we had our cat, Death Pan, our house cat, she had like a hard time because she didn't like being chased by Ruby. So we had to like she make- was older and Ruby was yeah, like Sam thing. So, Dustpan had to live in my room. Like, I had to put all of her stuff in my room, and she had to stay upstairs, and she didn't have free room of the house. And cats can do that sometimes, but I didn't feel like she was completely happy not being able to go wherever she wanted to go. And Sam thinks that. If you get a kitten, then Ruby can take care of it and won't have to chase it. Yeah, that could be true, but and honestly... And they would... All the dogs would be fine with it because it's a kid, right? Yeah. Let's just buy a kid. I don't know. I think we should vote. Let's 
Daisy would love it. What do, do what do you think? What do you think? Your dog, you guy, no. Get a kitten. No. I think at this house, and a kitten is like I'm hoping to get a puppy. I'm hoping to get a dog, a little dog soon. And I think at this point, like another kitten in our tiny house it would like the dogs would be on top of it i feel like but i would never stop you from doing what you want and i trust you to make the best choice for you get a ferret get yeah. a ferret teach the ferret to hunt right you so a small cart. i know i got this tiny little cart i love it so we're headed to look at shelves for gabby so we looked online and Gabby wants just a plain, she wants just a plain Jane shelf. She wants just a wooden shelf for her room. I wanted her to get like hanging up shelves. I should get a laundry basket for my room. You should get a laundry basket for your room. Look, that one. Do they have anything? All right, so that's the only one that they have at this store. We're gonna have to go to another store. It's way too short. She wants like a tall, narrow one. Gabby. What are the what series are you reading in those manga books? Somebody asked me. Spy X Family and Chainsaw Man. Spy X Family and Chainsaw Man. Yes, but it's going on the ground and it's too short. You want a tall one? Yeah. Semi tall. That's the size you should get. That size of narrow. Narrow. Taller. Too tall? All right, we found a too short one, and now we found a too tall one. So I have this friend, auto follow pet camera. So I have this friend, and she's been collecting baby stuff her whole entire life, even though she doesn't have a baby yet. She has like boxes of it. And so I was thinking, I obviously am gonna get a new dog. Just waiting to find the right one. So what if I collected dog stuff? In anticipation of getting a dog. And but Sophie's over here planning her new kitten that her dad no. said he wants to buy. For a dog? It, it's the yeah. same size as a kitten. Mom. Yeah, so Sam, so Again, Sophie yes. wants a tent. Look how cute. It could hide from Daisy when Daisy wants to be its mother. So the thing is, is that anything that I buy, I want to be pink. That's the, so that's the problem. Because I won't, I'm going to get a girl dog for sure. Okay. Everything Walmart has is blue. Isn't that weird? Like the whole line is all blue. Pooch Creamery. It's ice cream for dogs. Daisy's had it before. It's actually good. Oh my gosh. You have to stay here for at least one. So I, I love these beds for inside a crate. Like these are perfect for small dogs okay. for crate training. I like that. It's really cute. Daisy can't sleep without a cage in her cage. It's yeah, like Daisy fun. can't sleep without a bed in her cage. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> wait, wait, move. This is... <laughs> Size popping. In town, there's literally no snow, you guys. Isn't that crazy? But where we live, we still have a lot of snow. So we came to the pet store because they didn't have anything good at Walmart. But look, they have little tiny collars. Tiny. Oh, that's adorable. Look at the matching collar. Yeah, that's cute. Well, it's not really matching, but this clip is probably as big as her though. So this camera, do you guys notice that when we're in like fluorescent lights? Let me see if I can fix that. Okay, look, 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 look. Now we're normal color. All right, wait, I really want to get like a collar. Daisy would love that. I know what you're getting. Socks. Socks. I don't know, I feel like, I feel like there's nothing good. I just want a little tiny collar, like. Okay, let's pick one that matches this. Well, there's one right there. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's great. Okay. Is this the size she needs? I don't know. Is it cute? It's so, cute. It's so dark though. I thought I wanted like light pink. So freaking adorable. Are you gonna get these for her? I love those. Aren't they so, whoops. Aren't they adorable? And you all thought I was weird about liking skulls. Look, you can find them in the pet store. Those are fake. All right, so Sam wants to get a kitten, or a cat, a kitten. So 
Oh my goodness. You are so cute. I, I'm against it. Hello. I'm against it though. If one of these was pink, I would have it. I would buy that for sure. I like these little fuzzy ones too. This is Gabby's new shelf. It's really hard to show you guys. It's in a tiny little area here. She's gonna put it together herself. So this is slushy, but not necessarily slippery. It's like a little bit slippery, but not like, it mostly just caves down when you walk on it. I couldn't work with Penny yesterday because it was raining, pouring rain all day, like pouring rain. So uh, today's my goal. Like today I have to get her in there, even though if the weather's bad, it's supposed to be nice on the weekend, but if the weather's bad, then, then we'll have to forfeit our ride because I don't want our horses to get hurt for sure. But I also want to keep the momentum going with Penny because we've been working so hard at getting her in the trailer. So I'm going to try and do it today. I'm going to try and walk her on the slushy snow. I think she should be fine. I actually want to load her so many times till the point where she feels comfortable, like where it's just common for her to go up on a ramp. So that's my goal. Wish me luck. Come on. Girl, yeah. Good girl, you're such a smarty. I really noticed with her that when she has time to like stop and think about something, then she like does it even better the next day. Cause it will ricochet, I won't let it bite. I will look at you and tell you that I'm all right. <laughs> there we go. I t put, turn the camera off for one second and then she just walked on. She's like, Laura, I need your full undivided attention, please. All right, I'm gonna do it one more time. Let me tell you, not because my eyes are open, your words will keep bouncing on. Good girl. All right, do you guys think we're good? It's not the right day to take her for a ride, and I don't know if we're gonna get a chance to take her out there and bring her home and see if she'll go on. So I don't know if I'm gonna get to do that. I think she's gonna be okay though. Like she's gone on at least 50 times for me. She's gonna go back on again without me. Nope, we're not going back on. Come on. <laughs> I'm going back in. Nope, come on. <laughs> no, Penny. <laughs> oh my God, she's gonna freeload. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're the funniest girl. Come on, let's go. Good girl. Good girl. All right, well, I'm happy. It's weird the feeling that you get when you work with your horse, isn't it? Like, the feeling that you get, uh-oh. Come on, Pen, walk in the water. Because the mini is gonna drive the wind. Good girl, Penny people. Good girl. Nice. Be nice to the baby. All right, well, nobody can say that I didn't try my best because it's been a lot of hours practicing this week, like a lot of hours. Get in there, little baby. All right, bye ladies. I'll be back. I'll be back for dinner. Get out of the water now, Penny. I don't want your feet getting all soft. So today, Sophie and I went shopping for my future puppy. I definitely decided I'm getting a puppy. I want a puppy because for so many reasons, but I want a puppy and I feel it in my heart so strongly. And I feel God pulling me to getting a puppy. If I fall <laughs> on camera, hmm. it's not like I haven't done it before. <laughs> anyway, I'll show you guys all the stuff that we got for my puppy when I get the puppy. Thanks for watching. Don't you know that you're beautiful?